For Action News, I'm Anas Moska with your 2014 summer health tips, helping you have a fun and safe summer. And first up, when you think of sun exposure, think moderation. When out in the sun, use broad spectrum sunscreen protecting you from both UVA and UVB rays. Sunscreen SPF 15 or higher and reapply often. Many people like to start off the tanning season not outside but in a tanning salon. Not a good idea. Tanning rays emitted by sun lamps can damage the skin as much as true sunlight. In fact, the FDA just issued a warning that tanning beds should not be used by anyone under 18. Wear protective clothing and a hat and of course sunglasses with gray or green lenses and make sure the label says they protect 99 to 100 percent of UVA or UVB lights. If you notice symptoms such as a rash or flu-like symptoms, see a doctor immediately to rule out Lyme disease. To prevent Lyme disease, of course, exercise precautions such as wearing insect repellent containing DEET. Use insect repellent to prevent stings or bites and only apply to exposed skin and clothing. And if you have a known allergy to bites or stings, make sure you have your epinephrine pen with you at all times and know how to use it. And finally, when packing for vacation, grab your lip balm, your sunscreen, your prescribed medication if you have any, and your insect repellent. And don't forget your first aid kit. For more summer health tips, you can head to our website, aksha.org, that's acsh.org. And while you're there, don't forget to also sign up for your daily dose of news delivered right to your inbox. For Action News, I'm Anas Mosca. Have a great summer, everyone.